Speaking of new music, this record, Ray of Hope by uh, Sina Bathai, just came out two days ago. And right now, he is about to perform a beautiful piece on the Centaur. A first for the newsroom. Take it away. Hi, guys. Hope. Hey guys, this is Sina Batai, and uh, today I would like to teach you how to play uh, my piece Invocation on Santur in an easy way. Invocation is from my second album, Ray of Hope. Um, you can have a listen on SoundCloud, Spotify, iTunes, or uh, watch a live video on YouTube. Uh, it might sound a little bit complicated, but uh, it's not, and I'll teach you in an easy way how you can play it. So even if you are uh, beginner level you can still play. Uh, I will teach you how to play it on a standard 9 bridge Santur. You might notice that in the recording uh, it sounds a little bit different because I use the 11 bridge Santur which is larger and uh, lower uh, in sound but uh, it really doesn't matter. We can go through the piece on a, a standard 9 bridge Santur. Let's just start. The center should be tuned in G minor, which is basically B flat or A sharp and E flat or D sharp. All right, let's start. Evocation is uh, based on four note stroke right left right left which will be repeated throughout uh, the piece let's just start the section one the first four notes are d g a b repeat these 16 times Let's call this part A. On the part B, the first note will change to E. So the four notes will be E, G, A, B. We played 16 times. So the first section of this piece would be part A, 16 times, part B, 16 times, again, part A, 16 times, part B, 16 times and then one last time part A 16 times let's have a listen you can play it as slow as you want or as fast as you can that your techniques allows Section 2. We still have four notes as the basic phrase, but the first note of those four notes will change. The melody would be D, 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 C, D, B, A, G. But the three last notes will remain the same. Let's see. We play whole thing four times this would be part a of section 2 part b of section 2 is the same thing but the four notes are changed to e a b c and the melody is e e e d e c b a and again we play it four times
This is part B. So the section two of the piece is part A, four times the whole melody, and part B, again part A and part B. Section three, the four notes are D, D, B, G. And the melody on the right hand is the same as the part A of section two, which is D, 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 C, D, B, A, G. All together. Play this again four times. And we call it part A of section three. Part B, the notes are E, E, C, G. And the right hand melody is the same as the part B of section two, which is E, 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 D, E, C, B, A. C is C, D, D, G. We should play 16 times. Let's hear section 3. Section 1, part A, 16 times, part B, 16 times, again part A, part B, and part A. Section 2, part A, 4 times. This melody four times. Part B. Four times. Again, part A, part B. And then section three. Part A. This melody four times is part A of section three. Part B. This melody four times. And part C. This melody 16 times. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this lesson. This was a simplified version of the first part of invocation. Uh, I already wrote down the score and so if you want to have the score or if you want to have an online lesson and continue with the rest of the piece, you can send me an email or if you have any questions or need more guidance, please uh, feel free to send me an email. Uh, I believe the techniques that you learn through this piece you can use and do uh, improvisations and add your own melody and, uh, and create your own music and it's a very easy techniques but 
it actually uh, would help you uh, to get out of your comfort zone and uh, start doing improvisations and add melodies and um, putting these bits and pieces together, uh, these blocks of a rhythm and melody and making something out of it. Uh, I found it uh, very helpful to be able to get into the world of improvisation if that's something also that you wanted to uh, explore more. Uh, Alright guys, um, I hope you enjoyed this lesson and uh, see you soon.